Hi everybody! Today we're going to be looking at absorbency in our science lesson. So, on my board, I've got some questions. What is absorbency? What makes materials absorbent? And how does absorbency work? Pause the video now and have a little think and we'll come back together. So, on my table here, I've got a cup of water and a sponge. If I dip my sponge into the water, what do you think is going to happen? Have a little think. Well, as I pull my sponge out of the water, you'll notice there's less water in the cup and my sponge is a bit heavy. And then as I squeeze it, water comes out. This is called absorbency. It's when water is sucked up through a material. So how does this work? So my sponge here, this is a close-up. It's got lots of little holes in it. As I dip my sponge into the water, the water travels up through the little holes and makes a little home in them. As each one gets full, the water travels up through the sponge and eventually there'll be no room left. This is called saturation. So we are going to try a little experiment all about absorbency and all you need is some kitchen roll, some felt tip pens and two bowls of water. Go and get these now. If you don't have them, don't worry about it. We'll do it together. So the first thing you need to do is use your felt tip pens to colour in the ends of the kitchen roll in a rainbow pattern. Then take your bowls of water and dip your kitchen roll into the two ends. What do you think is going to happen? Try it now and see if the same thing happens to yours. So look here. Notice how the colour is travelling up the kitchen roll. This is where the water is being absorbed through the kitchen roll. And eventually, if you leave it for long enough, you will make a rainbow where all of the water has been absorbed through the kitchen roll and it was travelling up through the little holes. So, it will create a fun rainbow effect. On the website, we'll find the lesson for you, but you can also try and mix it up in your own way. Can you use different materials? Can you do it in a different way? You will also find a worksheet um, on the website for you to use. So have a go yourselves and show us what you think on Twitter. Bye bye.